I'm gonna go old school here, Sam. Okay, so first we draw our center axes. Then we draw our sphere. Then we chop out the center. Then we shade the skin. of this is point five two nine angstroms and there's a 59 percent probability of finding the electron there but what I have drawn here is a hollow sphere if you look at our graph can you find the electron closer than 0.5 0.529 angstroms? Yeah. The probability is less. As you approach the nucleus, the probability of finding the electron decreases. So it's not a hollow sphere, it's kind of like a sphere with a little light shading on the inside. The darker the shading, the greater the probability of finding it there. So there should be no shading in the center because the probability is 0%. Can't find the electron there. If I go further than 0.529 angstroms away, what happens to our probability? It decreases again. So we have light shading around the outside. And if we go out to infinity, what's the probability there? Zero percent. So we actually call this a fuzzy sphere because it's shaded on the inside, shaded on the outside. And this is only for psi equal to n equals 1. We have drawn the simplest graph. They will get uglier tomorrow. Okay? So, um, tonight for homework, I want you to read in the book, pages, chapter 5, in chapter 5, read pages 110 to 115.